Hey, hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to something new. This is Witchfire, a game which is currently in early access. You can kind of see it here, and it is only available through the Epic Game Store. But the trailer that they showed there really convinced me to get this title and try out. We will be this very scary looking guy here, and our task is to hunt witches. So let's get into it. A war rages between the witches and the remnants of humanity ruled by the church. Despite the numbers advantage, the church and its armies keep losing territories to witches and their foul magic. In a distant land controlled by one of the witches, papal scouts discover a wreckage of a ship that had been lost for several centuries. It carried a valuable artifact, one that could change the course of the conflict. Only witch hunters called prayers can face a witch and live. You are one of them, anointed by the Pope himself to recover the artifact. After a long and arduous journey, low on witch fire that gives you unnatural powers and with most of your belongings lost, you arrive at the destination. Woohoo! Oh wow, look at that. Oh, these look interesting. Let me take a look. Butcher, strong. He is quickly has a stamina of much younger man. Fearless in battle, what lesser men mistake for anger and rashness. What? Okay. Hunter, cunning fighter with steady hand and no ego. The mission is the only thing that matters. Everything else is mere distraction. Okay. Slayer. Fight Twisted Delight in wielding witchcraft to dispatch the witch play witch made abominations. Agile with talent for close range combat. And you manage to display it with a long range rifle. Hmm. Shadow. Respect witch magic enough to avoid unnecessary risk. Why slit throats when a bullet from a shadow archives? Uh, Shadow achieves the same end. Uh, okay. Saint. An avid student of the fates for Publilius Cyrus noted against a lucky man, even gods are powerless. Huh. Penitent. A hunted man cursed by his past and obvious to oblivious to the shadows looming in his future. Warning not recommended for beginners. Uh, I'll be honest with you folks. I see literally zero difference between any of these. I assume Butcher is supposed to be the one that is meant for beginners, but I think this one this layer might be interesting. This looks to me like a mage because it says finds twisted delight in wielding witchcraft to dispatch the witch made abominations. So basically I'm using witchy magic to to do stuff and I, I'm I try trying to you know kind of want to go with this one. Agile with a talent for close range combat. Well, I hope I do have it. Starting gear, cricket, handgun, and dash after a kill reloads the boost, reloads and boosts the gun. Lightning bolt, lights. Oh yeah, this was a good choice. <laughs> Witchery. <laughs> the more you study witch magic and open your mind to its esoteric truths, the faster your body is ready for another spell. Mm. Metanoia. Which word gives you life and unnatural powers? Metanoia. 
allows you to waste less volatile witch fire during the absorption process. Uh, so I basically gain more witch fire. I actually seen some gameplay, so you are fighting and every time you kill an abomination, you basically suck in the juices and that's what gives you like witch powers. Yeah, this looks good to me. Oh wow, and we are all ready here. Oh wow, well, give me one second. Well, how did we end up in here? It looks like a rope. And I cannot actually jump off this clip. I assume we're supposed to grab that. Oh. Yeah. I don't see any prompts. Oh yeah, that was the lightning bolt. Huh. I can reload. It would be nice to have some tutorial in in what is this. Yeah. I assume I need to grab that, but there's literally nothing immediate here that would work. Let me try some more obvious buttons. Hmm. Right, do I need to... Oh wait, I'm stupid. I probably come here, but I have not noticed this one. What a cruel trick from the developers. I thought this is just a small cave. And it turns out it is not. V dash run crouch. C by running to slide. Okay. What was the rest? Jump. Double jump. Okay. V to dash. I will probably need to... Oh, that's kind of already reconfigured to my mouse button. That's handy. Tutorial. To understand how to fight the witch and her minions, please interact with the prayer sigil. Or you can choose to ignore it and try to figure it out all yourself. Now this is a game for serenity. You can get back here anytime you were able you are in the Hermitorium. Okay. Let's do the tutorial. Follow the ashen lines on the ground to recall what it means to be a prayer. Oh yeah, there it is. Ask options, tab menu. M for map. Oh, okay, okay, this looks pretty straightforward. Apothecary, Ascension Shrine, Gun Room, Workshop Mirror. Oh, you know what this is? I kind of figured out. This is the safe house. Movement abilities and getting wounded cost stamina. Stamina replenishes over time, and by absorbing volatile witch fire from wounded or dead enemies, if you run out of stamina, you become tired. If you keep spending stamina while tired, you become exhausted and weak. Keep jumping to become tired, then exhausted. I'm now tired, and assume I'm now exhausted. takes a few seconds. Yeah, so if I'm just tired, then it re starts recovering quickly, but if you keep moving, then it will be definitely... <clears throat> takes longer. Revenant. Aim, fire, uh, reload. 
one to switch between weapons, switch to demonic weapon if you have it, I don't. Revenant. Hmm. Is there like a limit? Yes. When your health is fully depleted, you die. Heal your wounds by inhaling healing elixirs. You can manufacture elixirs in a nearby apothecary from Angelica. Plant you can find during your expeditions. Mm -hmm. Ouch. I think this is actually damaging me. I don't really see any plant. Witchery. Melee. Oh, that's me. Light F to light spell if you have one. Hold F to heavy spell. Well, I don't have any. But this melee was actually working. E to reset. Cooldowns. Huh. I... Ah, okay. This can work. Your spells use both stamina and witchfire in your blood. Okay. Calamity. Every mistake you make, such as getting hurt by a triggering trap, increases the calamity bar. When it's full, the witch believes your confidence is at its lowest and she will cast calamity. Her most powerful curse. Then you can try to find and destroy the catalyst a giant witchfire vortex that powers the calamity or fight the calamity directly okay e, e to make a mistake I like it <laughs> ah that's on the top hang on kind of wanted to make it Screenshot of this for future prosperity. <laughs> and one more. Destroy Calamity Catalyst or wait and fight Calamity. Kind of don't see any Calamity here. But I guess that will just show me how it will look like in the UI. Killing enemies increases your maximum stamina. With enough, enough kills, you will enter focus state for a brief moment after dashing. By looking at an enemy, you will see their soul. Sigil. Shooting it before it disappears will always stun the enemy. Any damage taken will reset the bonus stamina and put you out of focus. Look at the enemy and... Was that the red light? Huh. Oh yeah, now it's stunned. Hmm, okay. This area is currently unavailable. Yay for more tutorials in the future. Alright, I think I'm sufficiently... ...taught in the ways of witchery. Boxes cannot be broken. Nice. He is holding grapes. I think this will be the apothecary. Ah, look at that. A 
brew and grab potions. Angelica. Oh, that's like looking like that. Okay. I have zero. Wait, you zero left three out of twenty. Wait, zero. Alright. Okay, I think I kind of brewed everything. Healing elixir. I assume there's a button for it somewhere. I use the healing elixir, I think. But my health seems to be the same as before. Uh, Alright. Healing potions are broken. What the heck is that supposed to be? Portal. A late night anomaly manifested through witchfire magic linked to several other portals. Uh, okay. Let's go up here. Ascend. <clears throat> I don't think I have any to ascend to, but it's interesting to see. We need to come back here later. What is this way? Looks very witchy. Requires five thousand volatile witch fire. Uh, I don't think I will have that anytime soon. Wow. Okay, okay. It's a mirror. Equip gear. But <laughs> relic fetish ring. Oh no. <laughs> I don't have any fetish, I'm a boring man. <laughs> well, alright, you cannot comprehend this magic, required level 7. Uh, hmm, okay. I guess our only way to do stuff is through that portal over there. Let's jump, start a new expedition. Scarlet Coast, you can see the shipwrecks of the flotilla and the beach darkened by the survivors' blood. Hmm. Farther away, a small fishing village that looks abandoned and an old quarry. Witch defense is low, which fire gains 100%. Kill the witch's familiar or require resources to escape back to the her hermitorium. Okay, let's do that. Ooh nice foggy place. How much do I need to escape back? It doesn't say. I guess our only option. Find and kill the, 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 the M4 map. Okay. Ammo chest, okay. Dangerous area. Highly dangerous area. Extremely dangerous area. Dormant portal. Now in the crossing of flame lines, you can turn it into a portal back to the hermitorium, but there might be consequences to such action. Like what? Oh, what the heck? Which is first familiar? Oh, it's way up north. Dormant Echo, the portal you arrived through leads back to Herbitarium, but waking it up might not be easy. Well, alright, let's... Uh, let's explore! Wow. Hmm. No hidden chest there. And I thought there's an ammo. Oh, that should be the ammo chest up there, isn't it?
Collect demonic ammo. Cannot fit more of this. Okay. At least I came here with full ammo. Let's get in here and I think this way somewhere we will find something to shoot. I hear boots. Oh, what the shit? Oh yeah, I think I shot one of them. E to collect ammo. Boots, man. Is that like a grenade? I think it is like a grenade. Ouch. Alright, I think I got it. I don't need to shoot at them, I need to shoot at their soul, I think. That ball sack on the top of their head. <gasps> Holy Jesus. Hang on. <clears throat> I think I got it. Healing elixir and standard ammo. Oh boy, I'm almost dead. I'm hitting it for one. Oh boy, I run into one of the mines. I need to come out of here and see if I can heal myself. I think Q should be the heal, but... Yeah, one less perpetrator. Ouch! Standard ammo. Tiny witch fire shard. <gasps> I go to dead. Kills 10, event 0, chest 1. Witch fire 1000 lost. Okay. This was a weak sortie. But I kind of know what to do. Alright, here we are. Do I need to... Is that cleared out? I think so. Hang on. Oh, is that my... Collect your remains. Oh, I picked up the witchfire that I lost. Oh, okay, okay. That was not the... Smartest thing to do. Medium witch fire chunk. Okay. Let's blow up the toilet. <laughs> we cannot. 
Oh, I see some enemies there. I forgot that I actually have melee as well. And what the hell? And I'm frozen a bit. Oh wow. Never mind. Man. Absorb manifestation. Arcana firearms. Spells. Entropy. Attacks of decaying enemies are weaker. Varia. Use a witch raven feathers to unveil. I have two. Now I have one. Wait, I can actually either pick or reroll. Alright. At this point it doesn't tell me much, so... But I think we cleared this area a bit. Let me heal myself a bit. And then we can look around. Hello there, citizens. Strange coin. Protected by Calamity Hex, this remnant of the old age radiates with black magic. If you decide to pick it up, it powers, uh, its powers might bring unknown dangers upon you. Curse risk moderate. Cleanse with 3000 volatile witch fire. Which I obviously don't have, but I pick it up. Because why wouldn't I? Oh boy, look at that. No, 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 run, boy. Reload. Reload. Oh boy, that was a weak sortie. I thought I would go in there and do a melee, but I messed up. <clears throat> and I lost 3000 witchfire thingies. Wah. That's alright, I have time. I go back for one more. Hopefully the things that we cleared will not respawn. If the chests will not respawn, it would be a cruel thing. Oh yes, stamina. Collect your remains, yes. I very much would want that. Alright, I got my 3000 witch fire. Wait, is this... A loot box? With feathers. Almost looked like something was falling behind it as well. Hmm. Alright. 
Okay, they're getting there. I wanna see if I can melee these dudes. Ouch. Okay. Kinda. Absorb manifestation. Rejuvenation. Faster stamina again. Oh yes. Give me all the rejuvenation that I can get. Ask back. Alright, 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 alright. Oh yeah, I do see the 20% increase. Ouch. Hang on, boys. I'm not yet there. Ow! And I cannot shoot the, the magic thing yet either. Hang on. I might be running into some issues here. Uh, I don't seem to have... Healing. Oh, I have zero. Do I? Inventory. Uh, it seems I do only have one. I mean zero. I recall crafting like 20. Oh! That was a bit too quick. For me to east, but I'm coming back for it. Luckily nothing is lost, although I wish it would put me back at the beginning of the map, not, you know, in my safe realm. When I'm playing, I kind of want to keep playing, although I admit I suck at this. I was never too good with first-person shooters, but I'm quite intrigued by the story of this game. It's just a matter of actually figuring what... Hello. Ouch. Oh boy. Okay, okay. That was a mercenary. And it's not even a stupid one. He went around the house trying to flank me. Oh yeah. Let's eat it. Increased strafe speed when aiming down the side, okay? Use white raven feathers to unveil. Chance for a killed enemy to drop healing elixir. Yes. We definitely need that one. Oh, right now I have one healing elixir. I don't really know how I get that one. Okay. These bozos are gone. One less perpetrator. Oh, and they dropped the healing elixir. Alright. Ouch. Alright, I don't think I sufficiently explored this village. Give me a quick V second. 
Ah, look at that. Stuff. Demonic ammo. Huh. That was just one thing. Okay. Stingy loot. <laughs> Okay, there's something there, which seems to be a dangerous area. You will sense a strong aura of dark magic in this area, which is definitely aware of your presence. Uh, I kind of need a bit of a better indication that this is fully cleared out. Kind of like a crossed over school to see that I have nothing else to do here anymore. I mean, I probably finished it. But ever since it was not actually explicitly saying that I finished it, I'm kinda not sure. But let's move on to the next one. I'm pretty sure if my luck will remain as it is, I will probably see that village again. <laughs> First camp. Oh, hello. Conquistadors. That lightning did absolutely nothing. Oh, wow. And I got sniped. Oh, my gun disappeared. Oh, what? Wait, how did these guys get behind me? I was sitting melee and nothing happened. Oof. I guess this game is a tad bit buggy. No, oh, that's alright. I get back for my stuff and I say my goodbyes, folks, because... This will take a bit longer to master. <laughs> alright, where was I? I think through here. There is it. Alright, stuff recovered. And I say my goodbyes for this episode. I don't think there's a third person view. So that's me looking at you folks. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. See you folks in the next adventure. Bye bye.